It's back to school season, and whether you have a first grader or a first year med student, chances are you're shopping for them. But if you have a college bound son or daughter, you might want to know about some things not to send to campus with them. Are you thinking of buying your college student an ironing board? Chances are he's going to use it as a clothes hanger, not for ironing. The website dealnews.com lists several items you may not want to ship to a college student. A printer. You'll pay hundreds of dollars for ink cartridges so other students can use the printer. Colleges provide cheap printing. Expensive bed sheets. They'll never get changed and will have food stains on them in a week. An iron. It'll be used only to cook grilled cheese sandwiches, if at all. And a high-end laptop. A $500 laptop is fine. Expensive laptops end up stolen or dropped. And from the Dozen That Stink file, some things not to buy for younger kids. Cheap backpacks. They can hurt their back. No-name pencils and crayons. Come on, pay a few cents more. And a tablet in place of a laptop. Editing a term paper on a tablet? Your child may say, doesn't that stink? A laptop will do pretty much everything a tablet will do, and it'll be a lot easier. Bottom line, assume anything a college student takes to a dorm room or apartment will not last more than a couple of years. College life takes a toll on everything, so keep it simple so you don't waste your money. I'm John Mack.